What's up, guys? It is Jack and Michael from AchievementHunter.com, and we are doing a very special This Is, Michael. Why this is it is, special? This is El Shaddai Ascension of the Metatron. Oh, my God. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. Should have probably looked it up before that. Maybe. What, what's before a Metatron? That's, is that like a Transformer? Is that yeah. a good or a bad Transformer? That's the bad guy? Is it? Yeah. Okay. That's... He's a giant gun. No, wait, he's not a gun anymore. <laughs> no, he's like a tank or some shit. All right, so this game just came out today, uh, which is August whatever that is. date is. Come on, man. August 16th, jackass. That's what I just said. Uh, 2011. And um, Yeah, it's already it's already the 17th. You looked away. Come on, though. All right, so uh, this game just came out, and this is a, this is a very, very pretty game. I've seen uh, I've seen a little of it. You've actually had some hands-on with it. What do you think so far? I think, yeah, it's pretty bright. There's a lot of uh, <laughs> a lot of colors. You're like an outer space kind of deal, and you just whack the shit out of things. So it's like a it's like a third person whacker. That's correct. You run around with your giant stick and hit people. You have several different sticks. <laughs> you, just, yeah. you can select multiple sticks. Multiple sticks. Can you dual wield whacking sticks? I haven't gotten to dual wield sticks yet. Okay. And you can fight with your fists. All right. Well, it's a very crazy visual style. It's almost like the uh, there, there's another game like that where it's like a cell shaded type look to it. Is that is that what you would call this, or do you think this is no, not different? at all, You're no, completely wrong. Okay, I'm I'm totally way off. Yep. I'm looking at the box right now, man. This, this looks like it's cell shaded. I'm glad. There's a guy I'm with glad a, your research involved this, this looking guy, at the box for the <laughs> commentary. On the box, there's a guy who has like a wing for a collar, but it's popped. So it's oh like, yeah, he's, he's like he's, he's like an angel. Out. He's like an angel douchebag. Yeah, yeah. He's like an angel. <laughs> I've gathered so far, and it's like, hey, some angels. Being dicks. Nice. Go, go, go kill them. All right. So, wait, so you're killing angels? That's, yeah, pretty much the main goal. Fallen angels. Okay. Because they're naughty. So and, it's, uh, uh, uh. They didn't yeah. do their homework, and God's like, what the fuck? So it's kind of like, is it like Bayonetta at all, where it's just like crazy, weird, sort of religious undertones? Or overtones. It's not really <laughs> undertones. It's more like right in your face. Blatant, like, blatant like tones. When, uh, the first character you meet constantly is on the, self, is on the phone with God. He's like, sup, God. <laughs> sup, G. <laughs> Literally what it says. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, uh, the game looks interesting. Let's run through a few achievements Let's here. Let's do it. So we got four of the difficulty achievements. We have uh, Angels... And then principalities, dominions, and the seraphim, which are those are finish all the chapters at the various difficulty levels, uh, easy through extra. Which I'm assuming Ex you unlock when you beat it. You, you only had three difficulties to start. Okay, so so you so it's going to take at least two playthroughs then. Uh, unless there's a magic code for it. Okay, well we don't know the magic code yet, so we're going to go ahead and assume that you have to play through at least. Maybe once. you have to pray to God and unlock it. <laughs> There's the God code you have to yeah. type in. Is that was it? Uh, IDDQD. Is that what it was? God, oh, you're so young. I have no idea. Oh uh, yeah, you're so much older. That's Whopping Doom. Five years. That's Doom. Do you remember Doom? I remember Doom. Oh gee, I remember. IDKFA. All that's all the keys, full ammo. Come on. I think it's IDDQD was God mode. If, so, if I'm not IDK WTF. Move no, on. No, WTF didn't exist back then. <laughs> that combination of letters did not exist. All right. So how about I'll take the best you have, which is take every weapons. From all of the enemies and finish chapter ten. I don't know. Yeah. If that's a misspelling on my part. Or I don't know. No, I'm gonna leave no, no, it now. No, it's uh, it's like that. Oh, is I've it? read that. Yeah, that's, I don't know if it's misspelling on their part or they're just like take, take them weapons. Is, <laughs> well, is. it's funny because I was looking through the achievement list and all. So there are twelve achievements that aren't secret, and then there are thirty eight that are. Yeah, because this game's a bastard. <laughs> that's that's unfortunate. So we actually had to go look at a few lists of secret achievements that weren't like not unlocked yet, but still, whatever. How about Living Miracle for 30 gamer scores? Finish all chapters without a single game over. Yep, already not getting that one. <laughs> You've already had a game over? Well, there's achievements for uh, beating the bosses also without recovering, and it's yeah. kind of like you get the crap beat out of you and you go to blackout, and you literally just slap buttons on the controller. That's uh -huh. what it tells you, hit buttons to recover. Um, but there's achievements for not recovering, so I was like, well, I'll just die and game over. There Don't know go. if that works yet, but then I went, oh, shit, when I saw that achievement. <laughs> well, there, there's ones with, so there's out without game over, but there's also ones without continuing. Correct. So I don't know what the difference is there, but I'm sure you'll figure it out, right? No, nah, probably not. Okay. But. How about no problem? Finish any chapter without collecting any armor recovery items. Wow, that sounds not I've easy. only encountered one so far, but it was kind of like the tutorial, like, hey, pick this up. Yeah. So. So you're forced to pick up the armor. Kind of. I, I, I don't know if you're actually forced to, but it was. I hadn't read that achievement yet. So uh, okay. next time I come across it, I'll just not pick it up. All right. Then we've got three collectible achievements. I will mourn you, which is collect all entries in the prophecies of Ishtar, which is a terrible movie. Uh, Good listener, which is obtain all of the Freeman's notes, and quite a fine, which is collect the eyes of truth. That sounds creepy. Is Truth like some dude walking around and he's like, I've lost my eyes. How Possibly. I think he's like the, uh, <laughs> what the hell's his name from, uh, from Hook? I've lost my marbles. <laughs> was it for his eyes. Uh, that's me. Uh, that was, uh, oh, crap, now you said it. I did. It was Rufio and then Bangarang. Well, he wasn't there because he was like 100 years old. Uh, oh, God. He was there. Uh, yeah, yeah, he was, was, he, was, he was back there with, 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 with Winnie Darling. Correct. And then, 
Uh, I've lost my marbles. Yeah, and then at the end he gets him and he shakes him. He gets him his marbles. He's so happy, but he doesn't know he's <laughs> he didn't lose your marbles. Oh, you just have, you just have Alzheimer's. <laughs> That's horrible. All right, how about uh, Conqueror for 90 Gamer Score, which is earn a G rank in every chapter as a hard difficulty level. Uh, this is the there's two 90 Gamer Score achievements, this one and the one for beating it on extra difficulty. So I figured I'd point that one out. And the last but not least, the most impressive one out of all of them is Lord of the game. Metatron, which is zero Gamer Score, which is earn all of the achievements. This is the the platinum trophy essentially for yeah, the and game. Then, but they didn't give you shit for it. You zero get zero gamer score. gamer score. That's kind of lame, but that's extremely lame. I guess so, but I guess technically you're gonna get another achievement when you get this one. So you'll get hope. some gamer score. Well, it'd be impossible not to, right? Because um, you get whatever... Tell, tell that to Cars Racerama, <laughs> which is the get all achievements achievement, which I don't have, even though I have every achievement. Really? Thanks, Cars Racerama. Uh. Piece of shit. <laughs> it's 100 points, too. I got 900 in that game. Oh, that sucks. All right, well, uh, that's it for all of the achievements we're going to take a look at now, and I've got to go figure out who the hell that was in Hook. That's going to drive me crazy, dude. It's going to be fun because people are going to be yelling it during this commentary. All right, so you, re you recommend picking this thing up? That's pretty fun so far. Pretty fun so far? That's what I like to hear. We like video games up here Yay. at the Achievement Hunters. And we'll see you next time. Toodles. It was Toodles! <laughs> was it? That's think, the guy's name. I don't think his name is Toodles. I think it is, yeah. yeah what? Ah! <laughs> are you shitting me? <laughs> wow.